so here is my contact form as you can see uh, it's uh, two fields on the same line so and below is a button with uh, on full width so how to set up such web form let's go to WordPress dashboard let's go to uh, contact contact forms here's our contact form let's click on edit and here we can see all the code so before uh, so first of all we need to go also to uh, Avada I'm using Avada so you should go to your uh, team in team options and here is such file custom CSCs so here we need to set up two styles so here it is it's a style for two columns as you can see I have created class here uh, so it's uh, split it um, on half and created row so uh, I will copy this code so you can uh, use it in order to create uh, two lines so uh, simply copy this code to your custom CSS file then go to your contact form uh, here I set a font so simply open brackets font size uh, B means bold and here you can see I have closed closed it so bold closed and font closed here uh, we can see I'm using class column what we have used here what we have just created here and uh, in first column we add three uh, three fields so it's business name funding required and font number so here it is business name funding required and phone number this is first column uh, after that we should close it so here it is how we use it. so div class column and uh, put all elements what you want in uh, first column and then close column then open div class column again add uh, more elements in the second column and make sure to close uh, to close this column here and uh, after that as you can see I'm using uh, adding button in one row so here is our button I'm using uh, open uh, class for row, adding button in center, and closing uh, row. So button also using uh, ID. Here is ID name. This is custom style for button. So here it is. So as you can see, it's. Uh, button with 90% button color and text color on button also we have included here button weight and uh, button style so here it is so you can find all code in, uh, in the description below make sure simply to copy it and you will have such web form also as you can see uh, there is a background on form so how to add this background simply go to your page edit here is my form here is simple shortcut for web form and this form edit in container so I will edit it now we'll go to design option and here is background color I have simply put here background color and edit padding here. Also, it has uh, ID class. This means that uh, it's just to round these borders. If you want to round these borders, 
in custom CSS you should also add simply border radius 10 pixels this is how it works like all is pretty simple you will find all code below make sure to copy it and you can try to edit it and see online how it changes effect